My name is Jana Jennings, and I had a tummy tuck and lipo 360 done with Dr. Redden. Um, when my dad passed, um, I fell into a pretty deep depression, and um, I didn't realize that I had forgotten how to take care of myself. Uh, you know, people talk about plastic surgery and, you know, how selfish it is sometimes, but really, doing this and this was the first thing that I had done for myself and myself only. I am in such a better place. I am able to look at myself and feel confidence and feel, you know, that I I this is me. This was here the whole time. I just couldn't see it. So I actually went to a plastic surgeon in Austin, but um, I walked out of there almost feeling less um, because I went in, you know, just for a consultation for a tummy tuck, but I felt like I was, while I was there, I was kind of picked apart a little bit. And, you know, and then I finally brought it up to um, to Kimberly and she was like, well, you need to come see Dr. Rednam. So, you know, I. I didn't know a lot about her, but once I went in, I walked out feeling beautiful. And I hadn't even had the surgery yet. Um, Dr. Rednam, you know, she immediately pointed out like, you know, here's your natural curve, look at that waist, you know? And I'm looking at myself in the mirror and I'm going, oh, okay, I have a waist there, yeah. And, you know, and just pointing out how she could improve what I already had, as opposed to changing any part of me, which is what I was afraid of. Um, and she just, Dr. Redna made me feel so comfortable and so beautiful. And she had a sense of humor. She was it. As soon as, as soon as Dr. Redna um, finished my consultation, I knew that that was, that was it. I'm driving to another city and we're gonna get this done. You know, getting skin removal, there is nothing you can do about that. No working out, you know, as a matter of fact, the, the thinner I was, the more skin I had. Having that skin taken off, it completely changed everything. As far as getting any type of anything done, I would say, number one, feel comfortable with your surgeon. You know, I'm so glad that I didn't end up going with that first one, you know, just because he was cheaper, closer, you know, all the reasons you give yourself. Um, you know, number two, find the right surgeon for you. For me, it was Dr. Rednam all the way. And I knew, I knew as soon as she walked in the door and started, you know, showing me how beautiful I was and what she she could see that I didn't see, um, find, find the right surgeon, find the person who is good for you and do it.